Hello friends! In this video you'll see how have the actors of the movie Speed changed. You'll know their real names and age. I will show you how they looked then in 1994 and what's with them now in 2022. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go! Stephen Alan Rock he is a tourist who came to see Los Angeles and to whom not lucky enough to get on the booby trap bus. He can be a little intrusive and often tries to find someone to talk, doesn't panic during dangerous situations and is straightforward. Captain Mike Mahone works for the LAPD and is Traven and Harris immediate supervisor. He behaves confidently and often personally takes part in operations and assists his subordinates in every possible way in the shortest possible time. The role is played by John Martin. Sam is the driver of City Bus 2525 in Los Angeles. He is very familiar with many passengers and treats them in a friendly way. Sam adheres to all job descriptions and doesn't try to stop outside of stops. Got bullet wound because of Ray, played by Hawthorne James. Jaguar owner Glenn Plummer lives in Los Angeles and has a good income, which allows him to buy a good car. He is used to defending his property, even if the police are trying to take possession of it, dislikes driving too fast and is very protective of his Jaguar. Howard Payne was a former explosives cop, but after his resignation he became unstable and cynical, choosing a felonious path. He is smart and likes to calculate everything in advance, played by Dennis Hopper, who died in 2010 from prostate cancer. Harry, Jeff Daniels, is paired with Jack and it has a friendly with him. He often went on calls, but after being wounded, he was transferred to the office. Quite smart, knows the cipher business well and can remotely give advice on the neutralization of explosives. Helen was a regular passenger on the 2525 bus and was well acquainted with its driver, Sam. She's a rather polite and calm woman, but she can give it to panic in a dangerous situation. Wears stud earrings and a ring on her left hand. Ortiz Carlos Carrasco works in construction and does carpentry. He rides the 2525 bus quite often and it's not uncommon to see him in a dirty white helmet. Ortiz is not one of those who stays on the sidelines and always tries to help whenever possible. Boss passenger number one, together with other women, helped Sam after being bullet wound. She mostly wears clothes in restrained tones, but prefers to paint her lips with bright lipstick, has a wide smile and wears cat eye glasses with black frames played by Simon Gadd. Ray is a passenger of the 2525 bus who was committed an offense, which is why he was tormented by his conscience. He was afraid of the police and could act nervous in their presence. He often carries a small revolver with him, played by Daniel Villarreal. Robin works as a police officer in one of the Los Angeles precincts. She can work in the office, performing various assignments and, if necessary, go to operations. In the service, she is always carries a pistol with her. She was played by Margaret Medina. Mrs. Camino, along with other passengers, was caught in the situation and couldn't leave bus 2525. She dresses quite discreetly doesn't use makeup and doesn't wear any jewelry other than a wedding ring and wristwatch. She was played by Natsuko Ohama. Additional bus passenger number three often got on Sam's route and not infrequently liked to leave through the magazine on her way to work. She dresses elegantly and has well-groomed hands with neat manicures. Likes to wear massive beaded jewelry, played by Sonia Jackson. Brand of executive Patrick Fischler is an office building employee and was one of passengers who ended up in a booby-trapped elevator. He doesn't like it when his banter and reacts quite sharply to this, goes to work in a business suit and with a briefcase. 
young executive, despite his age, is quite qualified and experienced, and he communicates with his employees quite politely, but sometimes he likes to tease his friend and colleague. He is quite tall and has somewhat curly hair, played by Robert Mailhouse. Bob works in the Los Angeles City fleet as a driver for a bus marked 2748 and is a good friend of Jack. He is always friendly and loves to joke around, became an innocent victim of a crazy pain, wears a ring on his left hand, played by John Capadice. Jack Craven serves in the police and can often act recklessly, which sometimes angers his partner. He is quick-witted, has good intuition, and knows how to make decisions quickly, possesses extreme car-driving skills. The role was performed by Keanu Reeves. News cameraman worked for one of the Los Angeles news channels and, along with the rest of the team, monitored the situation with the mined bus 2525. He is well-versed in the equipment, but doesn't like to be rushed. The role is played by Todd Garden. Train driver operates in the city subways and was assigned to the Western Train 501, which was later captured by Payne. Despite the fear that he might be shot, he tried to discreetly warn the dispatcher about the situation, but died, played by Richard Schiff. Vince, Tommy Rosales Jr works at a cafe in Santa Monica where he serves customers at the bar making coffee. He is quite friendly and is on good terms with regular customers and knows what kind of coffee they prefer to drink, wears shirts with floral prints. Additional bus passenger number 7 was frightened by the bus 2525 mining situation, but she kept her composure and tried to do everything that was demanded. She likes to tie her hair in a ponytail and wears medium-sized hoop earrings, played by Julia Vera. Additional bus passenger number two has a rather calm nature and often sat at the window in transport. Despite the fact that he was in a booby trap bus, unlike the others, he tries not to panic. He was often seen wearing a small hat. The role was played by Milton Kwan. Bartender Sandy Martin served the CAT team McMahon, which celebrated the receipt of awards for the liquidated terrorist. At work, she can be seen in the black and white unisex uniform, and she also prefers to wear short haircuts. She quite polite and smiling. Terry was one of the passengers in the bus mind and at first didn't believe in the presence of a bomb, believing that it was some kind of joke. He likes to wear a free striped shirt and has a small earring in his left ear. The role is played by David Kriegel. Annie is a positive and sweet girl who is quite friendly but doesn't like persistent interlocutors. Knows how to drive a car but often exceeded the speed limit and lost her license. Smokes cigarettes and likes to drink coffee. She was played by Sandra Bullock. Workman James Dumont he is listed in the security service of one of the office buildings in Los Angeles and is mainly engaged in checking the premises for the presence of strangers. He clearly follows job descriptions and at the same time remains extremely polite. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share it on social networks, like it, and of course, subscribe to the channel.